hi guys welcome to my channel it's lolo beauty and before we get started i just want to say everything in this video is alleged so our man has got his single to peep on billboards at number 11 so that is amazing our man is back on the billboards with another single and so y'all his career is gonna take off it's, it's going where it need to be and so i am so proud of him for that i just want to say congratulations our man your this song is my favorite this is my favorite this is number one on the list so far even though we only got two to rock with right now that's my number one i really love that song i love the what he said in the song this is what caught me when he was like i love you like i love my mama and my daughter i was like oh that's deep so, so yeah that's definitely one of my favorites and um yes and i've been catching up on a vacation vlogs and they think they seem like they had a really good time in the bahamas um i love seeing how regine is just as protective over our mind just like he protective over her when he was on that jet skis i seen it all come out regine was so worried she was like be safe i knew he was gonna get on this thing and act up you know you could tell that she really 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 genuinely cares we all we already know the love she got for him but when you worry about your man in that kind of way yeah that's deep deep so it was really good to see her worrying because we already we already know our man do not like to separate in the stores he ain't gonna let regina out his sight and so i love seeing her be that way like he better get on the, these jet skis and do right because i want him to be safe so yeah i love watching a bahamas vlogs i thought um it was a really cute vlog and when they got back they did a um we're back at home vlog and i love that too i love when they're just in their element they're not really doing that they just sitting and talking to us that is the best when she was singing our mind's song to him and she knew all the words and she was just vibing to it she oh my god i'm like we all need to support each other like that in your relationship always be your spouse number one fan you can't that, that's like come on like i love that about them both that they're each other's number one fans no matter what and you know what else am i the only one that if regina laugh at some our man gonna laugh and it's gonna trickle through the screen to me i'm laughing with them i love that if one laughs the other one gonna laugh okay i'm like yeah i'm like i'm feeling it and so um and i like that regina is gonna always have our man's back okay she gonna always have his back and he's gonna always have her back and i also love mondrian the way he shows them both support um shout out to mondrian because he's been doing his thing on youtube you know collaborating with other youtubers and i've been watching his videos because i always support him as well and one of the questions was name three um act actresses and his number one and only answer he could get out was regina carter i was like okay mondrian when i say the support is through the roof with mondrian it's through the roof so shout out to you mondrian because you the goat for that but um yeah i have y'all been supporting the single and how do y'all feel about the vacation vlog and I do feel like, I don't know why I feel like this, but I feel like they're going to be trying to move this year. And any one of y'all, any of y'all get the vibes that I feel like, I don't think they're going to just up and root from Atlanta, but I do feel like I see a new place coming in their horizon. I don't know why, but I feel like they are definitely going to get a place in LA or somewhere together. I just see that being a thing. Um, I love how close knit they are and I love how unbreakable they are. And I love that, you know what, even on the internet make their own assumptions about this couple. They, 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 they kill it every time. It's like, and you know what, our man, I just, I want to just tell you, you ain't got to respond to these people that don't know a thing about you. You don't owe them nothing. You don't owe them nothing. We see who you really are. The people that love you and support you will always love and support you. And the ones that don't, don't. Because he get a, he be getting a lot of slack. I see him addressing a lot of things on Twitter. And I feel like he don't need to address a thing. It, you know, he can move how he want and when he want. That's a good man. And I feel like with all good people, 
people look for reasons to not like them or re or, or their flaws and everybody has flaws and i feel like our man's weakness is his daughter and his character like he doesn't like to be viewed in a way that's not him he's going to he don't like that he don't like the hate he and i i feel because he's such a good guy so it really bothers him when he's getting a lot of hate and he loves to like start clear it up and i don't think he clears it up for the haters i think he does it for the people that rock with him the most but you don't even got to do that because your, your people going to rock with you regardless. You don't owe Twitter Twitter haters nothing. Don't leave no crumbs for them. That's how I feel about it. And so, um, yeah, that's just how I'm feeling about it. Don't leave them nothing. <laughs> but I loved um, seeing him in the Bahamas for the first time. I like that he, um, you know, racking up on the passport on the trips and stuff i i love to see it and i cannot wait to get 2023 vlogs because i see a lot coming for them this year i really do i see a lot of fun a lot of growth you know just a lot of opportunities for them both so i feel like we're gonna be front and center to all of that all of the beautiful stuff that's coming um to this and i hope that he gets to see his baby girl sometime soon because i feel like that's been wearing wearing on him a lot and i'm just praying that we all send him some love that um he gets legacy soon because i can just tell that he misses his baby and you know i don't know i just i, I pray that that gets better for him in 2023 but, um, yes, their vaults have been everything. He's back up on the billboard. And he about to drop us with a, another single. And I like how he said every song he dropped is not about his girlfriend. So, you know, artists express themselves through their music. So, we're going to get a lot of time, you know. He might express some pain he had in his previous, you know, situation. Or he might express other things that's going on in his life. And... I love that. I love to listen to what artists is what an artist feel in the moment, what they felt in their past and what they want in their future. You get all of that through an artist and their music, um, their growth and everything. So no matter what he's singing about, I am going to ride with him and I'm going to support it. But what single do y'all want him to drop next? I'm torn between the two. I really, really don't know. But listen. I'm going to be here for them both, and I'm going to support them both. But I do feel like um, 2023 going to be a good year for Armand and Regine. Y'all let me know down in the comment section how y'all feel.